Look at these guys who got spell the game is. <laughs> My name is Games of Kings and welcome back to the Horde Massacre of Smarted Days to Die. Every time I log in, these guys are back. And there was a couple of theories. Uh, one of them is simply that it's just like that now until you start a new world, which, you know, I'm not. Uh, another theory is that somebody says, well, you have to make sure you kill every single thing, including all the wasps, and it will stop. So the idea is now that hopefully... Oh, yeah, okay. I still get that error. Somebody was asking me if I got that error, and yes, when you leave loot in... Oh, look at that. Don't... Don't be like that. What, what did the house ever do to you? You just don't want to die, do you? Excellent. There you go. You, your legs just burst off. Anyway, so we have a nice free area now to loot all the bags, which is lovely. And hopefully we're going to get some extra notes. Already got some. So what I did is I logged back in. There was some more guys. And... Oh, man. I don't know what to put all that stuff now. Actually, let's get rid of the torch. Uh, no, let's eat that. And... Let's scrap that, and let's scrap that. There we go. And um, I got uh, a horde. I killed about half of them and said, oh, screw that. So, you know, I have to test if that still actually happens every time. So I locked back off, locked back on, and the horde came again. So, yes, they absolutely come every time. I think we already know that. Yes, science level 19. There we go. Brilliant. There's another guy. So now we killed everything. There's not a single wasp. There's not nothing there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to repair a couple of the, uh, my... Oh, there's another note. Very nice. I like it. Oh, man. I don't mind fighting them, actually, to be honest. I have no issue with that. I just run out of ammunition. That's my problem. There's another note. And I don't know what to spend all the notes on now. I think carpentry is definitely going to be one of them because... We obviously want to make sure that we can... Oh, yeah, I don't need the rotten flesh. We obviously want to make sure that we can um, defend ourselves and, you know, build build more things, you know, like out of wood and, and all that jazz. So we definitely want to do that. Look at all these bags, man. This is unreal. Unreal. If, if all of them would actually... Oh, look, there's another note. How many notes? We got five notes, like, just from this run. Or six nodes or something. Yeah, something like that. Wow. Okay. I think that's it. So, I don't think the location here is the problem. Because that is just the way it is. But I definitely want to start um, doing something more than just concrete. We need to get faster at things. I'm going to have a thing about what to spend the, the nodes on. And actually... Do you know what we're gonna do is we, we're gonna clean up the house we're gonna keep this episode short because i need to ask you guys what you would like to do yeah so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna gather a couple of feathers i'm gonna get some ammunition i'm uh, going to get myself ready ready to take on another horde before we move out i'm gonna do a lot of repairs and then we're gonna see what we're gonna do because i don't know i don't know Will if we get that every single time when we log in the only thing I can think of that might fix that is um, I Go to one location log off and as soon as I log on then I will walk in a different direction because usually what happens is the zombies spawn and their focus at the time of spawning on your location, but then when you move They actually don't follow you unless they see you But they won't see you because you're moving away as soon as they spawn so, which means you will walk away while they're just path through them. So we can trick them like that. I think that would be a plan. We can do that. We just have to make sure we don't log off anywhere in the building where we actually want to stay. So, okay, let me get my bearings and then I see you guys in a minute. Okay, so. After some to and fro, I decided I know what I want to do. So what I spent my recipes on is on the handlebar. And on the crossbow schematic. And that is because if we have to fight a frequent horde, I need the crossbow schematic because it unlocks the crossbow bolt and the steel crossbow bolt. Now, seeing that I'm actually a survivor and I started off with an iron crossbow, and I already know those recipes, I find it a bit weird that I just didn't read the rest. So it should actually have given me that recipe up front. But hey ho, 
That's the way it is. Was worth the 10 notes that I paid for it. So let's read that. So I should be able now to craft these guys. There we go. Iron crossbow balls. Craft. Nice. So while these are crafting, we also learned the handlebar. Now the reason I learned the handlebar schematics is very simple. I now can make a bike as soon as I have an engine and a battery. Which shouldn't be taking too long to actually find. That's what we're going to take this uh, wrench with us for. Now, we're going to leave bullets here. Um, yeah, I'm going to have some problems trying to take everything I want to take with me, actually. Because um, what I want to take with me is especially that bullet tumbler. And I'll show you now why. Because if we do this and we do steel arrows. Come on. Ah, steel arrows. Recipe. Steel crossbow bolts. How cool is that? So we can convert our steel arrows or our iron arrows we find into crossbow bolts, which is pretty cool. So we're going to have 50 normal ones now. And um, the iron crossbow bolts here and the steel ones here. So which is pretty cool. So we have enough ammunition actually to take with us. Now we also can right now craft, I think, the bike things. Let me see. So the mini bike, all we need really... Oh, we need more duct tape. Oh, we have enough duct tape. We need more leather. No, we have leather. Cotton. So I'm going to pick up some cotton, actually, now as well. Can I pick that up by hand? No, I have to hit it, actually. I think it was my hand. Let me see. Yeah. So I'm going to pick up some cotton. Then we're going to make a mini bike seat. We're going to make a mini bike uh, a handlebar. And that also means I don't have to carry around with me all those different ingredients uh, or components because uh, we can just craft them and use them instead i also want to make sure i found enough feathers along the way and that way we should be sorted so what we're gonna do is we're gonna head then north i think let me just get a couple of those guys here whoops sorry and we're going to head we are going to head over this way and see what this village was about up here or whatever that was and um we're going to leave the bed here, so we're going to have enough resources here, but first we're going to loot these two buildings here before we do any of that, just to make sure if we find any more recipes or any, any other useful thing like a wrench, so we can take apart cars for engine parts and whatnot, so we can craft the rest of the bike. And then we have a bike. All we need then is a shopping basket to put the loot in the back, and that is it. Which we can easily find, I suppose, uh, once we come across a town or something bigger, biggish like that. So I'm gonna start gathering that these components and gonna craft them, and then we're gonna go outside. So the only thing I'm gonna take with me is then the um, oh, watch me call it is the tumbler, because the rest I can craft anvils and calipers I can craft. I have a forge with me, so we have, we have a place to stay and uh, be able to, to craft something or mine something, whatever, and burn something, but um, that's the main point. Anyway, so I'm going to see you guys in a second. Okay, so we're going to leave this here. Uh, what I made, I made a call and I had some notes left and I bought the glass jars because that way, or the glass working, because that way we can make glass jars when we really need to and we shouldn't be in too much trouble. Now we need to find food, we need to find a lot of things and I'm going to leave the space here for now. The bed is up there and we are heading over to the other village, well, the other houses. I need to find some bird's nests along the way. So we can craft more bows, and, uh, more arrow, more crossbow balls for the iron crossbow balls. And um, we're going to loot these houses now before we move on to where I said, oh yeah, let's take the cars apart because we are looking for engines and for batteries so we can make uh, the bike. So let's see if we get lucky. So we get some springs, springs brass and for the moment this will actually get scrapped so I don't really mind okay that will not work so it's only the first layer really oh hello I already have somebody interested in, our, in us but there's loads of cars up front there so hopefully we're gonna get a, a battery or something leather is good oh leather is very good actually Oh, it's a pity about the space, I'm telling you. Now, clay. Do I need clay, actually, for anything in the moment? I don't think so. And there's clay always around, really. So I don't... Ah, well. For the moment, let's just keep it all and see. So more leather. 
nothing falling down no a battery would be nice on engine battery or engine would be pretty nice no oh yes there's an engine sweet so now we have an engine all we need is battery who is that oh creepy crawly hey Do you have a battery on you by any chance? No? Okay. Um, okay, so for the sake of being able to move on, maybe the lead I should just leave. Or actually, the torch. We'll leave the torch here for now. And let's just do this. So that way, if we come across an engine... Uh, sorry, a battery. That was a really good find, a quality engine. So let's see if we can find a car battery as well. And that would be so awesome, because being able to make uh, the motorbike now would be just absolutely brilliant. Okay. No. Nothing here. Ah, oh, another engine. And it's 442. What are, what are you going to do with the engines? I mean, the only recipe is... Oh, a cement mixer. We could make a cement mixer. That would be a thing. Um, But now we're full. Oh, man. I hate... Be okay, eggs. Sorry, you got to go. We're going to have to find other food. We're going to have to eat. So let's see if we can get a battery. Okay, we get some fuel, which I don't want to keep right now. No. Okay, great. Yeah, I'm gonna I actually left all the tools behind and I'm just gonna take the stone axe. And that was intentionally because the stone axe takes up less space. So let's see if we can find a wrench here. No. No wrench here. They're usually in the bathroom, I think. What does he have on him? Bullets. Not taking them right now. Uh, oh, I have that lump of coal here. Oh, look at that. Awesome. Ooh, nice. Yeah, we're gonna get in with that quickly enough. Oh, love it. Oh. Wow, these guys are loud. Ugh, no books. What? What? A double bookshelf and absolutely nothing to read. Yeah, I'm not gonna take any of. I have to be basically very smart on what I want. Once I have the ability to make the motorbike, it should be all very, very straightforward. We have a lot. We need and only to find a basket. Okay, so where's the where's the noise coming from? Come on, guys. Seriously, cut on. Okay, that's just close, close. There will be more building episodes as well, guys, so don't worry. Oh, they're coming from two sides now. Be careful. There we go. Ah, I knew it. I knew she would be coming out. It's always very risky to go between two fighting entities. Okay, let me see what we have here. Oh, more food. Oh, we don't need to eat right now. That's good. Okay, hi, guys. Nice. On the noggin. Oh, stay down. Nice. Okay, so what do we have here? Another iron hour ahead? Okay, oh, I keep pressing E when there's still stuff in the inventory. So the best thing is actually to throw things out. Oh, no. It's still... Okay, so let's scrap that. Let's scrap that and escape. Actually, leave that alone. So let's see what we have in this room here. Is there anything else in this room? Oh, there's a bag. Sports bag. Very nice. Ah, not going to use any of that now. A wrench would be lovely. Oh, we can use that. Very nice. And we can eat that. Gives us hydration as well. Nah, okay. Okay, let's get out of here and let's loot the other house. Oh, there's one more door. And then we loot the other house and then we're gonna leave this episode. I know it was probably a shorter episode than usual, but that is just because I need to make my mind up. I don't know what I want to do. I read one of the comments now that said, oh, if you just keep on playing, Eventually they stop, 
Oh, do I have shades on me? Yes, I do, but these ones are better. So I'm gonna wear them instead. And I'm gonna scrub these. Oh! There we go. Nice! Love it! And there's no, is there another upstairs? I think there's another upstairs. Oh no, we already covered that. So let's go and get the other house. Building, getting a car battery would just be the absolute best thing now. Now everything is just relying on that car battery. Everything. Scrap that. Uh, paper, we don't really need right now. Oh, nice. Okay. So now we have blueberry meat, which I'm going to drink. And that is going to give us some hydration back as well. So let's just take that for now. Nice. This is actually very, very good. I don't... Oh, man. Let's get rid of the one pipe. And... We need the red tea to cool down. But these ones are actually pretty awesome. So, let's see what we have here. Is there any... Oh, an improvised... Oh, improvised traps. Nice! Awesome! We found a recipe. This book teaches you how to make trap spikes to defend your base. Trap spikes. Interesting. I have no idea what a trap spike is. Okay, wood spikes is not a trap. Wood spike traps can damage. Oh, okay. So that wasn't very exciting then. I actually didn't read now on the bottom what it said it gives me, but um, yeah, it didn't. It wasn't. I wasn't that exciting. It was actually just spikes. Yeah. Okay, this is gonna go fast now, and that again is very fast. So the door should open now. There we go. Oh, balls. This is going to take forever. We're not going to do this, are we? No, we're not. Because there's... Uh, in a way, I want to do it in case there's a recipe book in it. We're going to do it last, okay? So you guys don't have to suffer through it. I'm just going to come and blend it in then. Ooh. Give me a wrench. Give me a wrench. Just give me a wrench. Why can't you just give me a wrench? Would somebody just please think of the children? Okay, flower. We don't need flower now. Maybe there's a wrench in the toilet. It's a fancy toilet. Oh, balls. That was stupid. Oh, man. I accidentally broke that. Oh, bookcase. Oh, explosive, explosives 101. Nice. Oh, I already knew that. And a leather schematic. Did I already know that? No, I didn't. There we go. Yeah, I'm, oh, in a way, I want to go for the treasure map. Oh, let's see how far it is away. Let's see, how far are you away? Taylor's treasure map should be marked on the map. Oh, it's all the way over there. Yeah, we're probably not going to do that right now. So let's go up here and see what we have up there. Probably nothing of interest. Oh, a dead body and a bag. Oh, that's a lot of interesting stuff. And I think that's it. Oh, there's another bag. Holy balls. Oh, we have to go back to the house. I can make a shotgun. Oh, yeah. This is going to be awesome. We're going to take a shotgun with us, guys. Oh, yes. That is going to be awesome. Because I have all the parts for a shotgun. Except this one. So what we're going to do is we're going to have to go to the other house again. Remember, we saw the shotgun shells. Yeah, we're going, we're going to um, need them. <laughs> because we're going to need to make shotgun ammunition. So it seems that we're going to start off in the... Oh, is that a basket? Oh, that's just a basket to search. Ooh, excellent. Is there not a basket also in this room here? Like a loose one, no? No. Ah, she damn. Anyway, we're going to get those uh, shotgun shells. We're going to go back to the house. We're going to make the shotgun. And... Oh. That's only four. But um, I suppose better than nothing. Recipes. Iron crossbow bolt. Craft. Take these guys out. Okay. So we. I'm going to take apart the... What should we call it? The safe, the, the gun safe, and then I see you guys back at the house. 
Okay, see, let's see what's in there. Maybe we get lucky in this recipe and or something. Oh, shotgun shells. That is good. That's good. I'm gonna leave the leather here because we can make more leather. And we can't really convert... Um, I leave the one here. Hunting rifle barrel. Oh, don't tell me I can also make the hunting rifle now. Oh, balls. If that's the case, I'm gonna have to come back again. So, we're gonna leave that here. Excellent. Okay, let's go back to the house now. And... Um, Let's go back to the house now and make the shotgun. Oh, that's just set. And let's see if we can make the hunting rifle as well. That, that was a really good find, these two parts. Oh, let, let's not forget the shells. We have a magnum, we have magnum rounds. And what does the hunting rifle take? 7.62 and 7.62. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take these guys here, go to the tumbler. Ah, not this one, here. I actually should have taken the tumbler with me. And we're gonna see for this. Oh, I can't. Look at this. I can't because, oh man. Oh, it's a perk. So let's see. Pistols, firearms. Oh yeah. Firearms. Skill perk, 9mm 7.62. Oh, we need gunsmithing at 30. How much is our gunsmithing in the moment? Our gunsmithing is... Shotgun shell gunsmithing is at 6. So we could theoretically get that up to 30. Which would be okay. So let's just do that. Excellent. Oh, now we can make shotgun shells. There you go, look at that. So we can make that, which is good. And then we also want to make... The, the 7.62 millimeters. Thank you. And we want to make the Magnum. Oh, the Magnum unit gunsmithing 40. I think we can do that. I mean, what else am I going to spend the points on, really, to be honest? There we go. And off we go to gunsmithing. Uh, sorry, to Magnum. Oh, excellent. So we were able to actually make this episode longer after all. And look at that. Now we have three beautiful guns with us. We can make the shotgun. We can convert all these rounds into useful rounds between um, Magnum and 7.62. So we have 92 of those. We have 37. So let's make more Magnum rounds first. I always go in the wrong, in the wrong uh, tool. So recipes, magnum rounds, we can make 41. Excellent, let's do that. So that's gonna be then 41. And let's see, there we go, nice. That's approximately the same amount. So we now go to the nine millimeter recipes. We can make 28 of those. So. Yeah, let's do that. Nice. Okay, so these bullets are crafting. I'm gonna make some shotgun shells with the rest of the ammunition. And I'm gonna build myself a gun first, obviously. So let's put these and the springs we're gonna leave here. Don't really need to take them with us. So let's make, let's take the shotgun here. Bomb, 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 bomb. And assembly, shotgun. There we go. All the parts are there. Brilliant. So we have a working shotgun now. We're also gonna take some repair with us. We're gonna repair this. Sweet. And we're gonna repair this. Awesome. Look at that. Absolutely fantastic. Three guns available to us and three ammunition. That should definitely allow us to survive a couple of hordes, if not even more. Because this guy here is, e is easy. 39 anti-damage, 37, 44. Obviously the Magnum is the highest. That is brilliant. Excellent stuff. So, I'm going to leave this episode here. In the next episode, we're going to start in this house, but immediately walk away. So the horde shouldn't really bother us. And, um, yeah, then we're just going to... Will we walk through the night? Uh, I'm probably just going to stay the night here and then log off. So that we get the horde in the morning. That we don't have to deal with the running horde. Anyway, yeah, I'm going to do that. Le leave it here. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode, even though it was a bit more in and out. A little bit more chit-chat and a little bit more... Um, 
looting and trying to trying to figure out what we're gonna do and learning recipes and all that but anyway i hope you enjoyed it anyway if you did remember to kick the like button in the balls and i hope to see you guys in another episode until then as always viel spaß and happy gaming <laughs>